At San Francisco International Airport, anticipation fills the air. Miss E told me all of a sudden I, that I'm going to China, and then I was so nervous during school. This has been like on the top of my like most most things I'm looking forward to. I've just been like waiting for the state. Chinese President Xi Jinping announced during his U.S. visit in November a program to invite 50,000 students to China within the next five years. I hope that after arriving in China, the students will actively participate in various activities with an open mind, personally experience Chinese culture, taste Chinese cuisine, make Chinese friends, and see a real three-dimensional and a comprehensive China. It's all so meaningful. You change one person's life at a time, and you cannot measure it with price, with dollar sign. You just have to do it with your passion. A total of 24 students from two Washington State High Schools, Stillicum and Lincoln, are making their trip via Air China. It's a relationship with China that stems all the way back to 2015, when President Xi visited the greater Seattle area, including Lincoln High School. Stillicum Mayor Dick Murray is accompanying the students. They're going to take back some memories, and not only are they going to learn, but I think the people in, in China are going to be uh, enjoy meeting these young uh, high school students from the United States. The students will indeed have a jam-packed trip. They'll get to see the Great Wall, the Forbidden City, high schools, universities, and even energy companies to see China's emphasis on creating a green economy. That's all going to take place within 11 days. I'm excited to see like the different cultures and everything. And I'm also excited to see the Great Wall of China because I've always wanted to see it. I was thinking about um, how big of an impact this is going to have in years to come, like way after I graduate. And just looking back on this experience and saying, wow, I really was a piece in kind of tying that relation together. And this thing that I did that was, you know, handed to me, given to me by my teachers does have an impact and I have an impact. This will be my fourth trip with students to China. So it's led to any number of just opportunities for different students. Um, I think the power of music comes through in lots of different ways. Eisenhower, a music teacher, has even taught her students to sing on the field of hope. Mark New, CGTN, San Francisco.